on the headquarters. Jim Acosta is there. We're getting ready to hear from uh, Mitt Romney. We'll take his speech, of course, live. Anderson, that's why I love covering politics, because you know what? You never know what's going to happen. And we're, Mitt Romney's son right now is uh, is speaking to the crowd who uh, is waiting for, for their candidate to appear, Governor Romney. Uh, we, of course, are going to bring that uh, to you live. Uh, Ari, from what you're hearing, though, from people on the ground, they still anticipate uh, uh, Romney pulling out some sort of a win. Yeah, these are not people with the campaign. These are people who are in Colorado, know the Colorado field. Uh, and that's their assessment. They still think that it's going to be a Romney win in Colorado. Wanted to take a quick look at this red bleed problem I'm having on this Sylvania color tabletop, and you can actually see the bleed here in between the bars. I'm adjusting the fine tuning. You see, I get the green edge just like I do on the faces but there's really uh, kind of smear throughout it's not just the red it's the blue and green I'm taking a look at this on a uh, Electrotech model V7 vectorscope and I'm really not that familiar with how to use this this is only the second time but I would have to say that looks pretty crappy right there. And uh, I'm going to adjust the tint. This is adjusting the tint. You can see what this does down here. It shifts. intensity you can see it it's it kind of overloads right there yeah this red bleed The way this red reacts is what's troubling me. Why is the red, it's like it's delayed or it's not, it's off to the right side of the bar and I don't think the fine tuning will adjust this. I think I'm going to take a look at this on my CTC-16, which has a pretty good picture. Okay, here's what the 16 looks like. Virtually no bleed. There's still a little bit of a green shadow to the left, but there's no bleed. The green is a bit weak on this set, though. And, uh... Looks a little bit different. Again, here's back to the Sylvania. Much nicer greens, but the 
and that's the best I can get that to look. I can't. That's turning the fine tuning. I wanted to note that looking at this, cranking the color intensity up and down, which is what I'm doing, you'll notice that the individual fingers don't get longer, but this whole entire circle in the middle gets longer. The fingers are not that defined. And no wonder why it's smearing, because everything is just smeared together. There's no separation here. Going back to the RCA, you'll notice that as I adjust the color intensity, the circle size in the middle stays the same. And the fingers get longer.